This is Ray Felix and Bronx Heroes. Back to you, Billy. <laughs> it's your boy Crazy Al Kane. I'm here with Ray Felix, Bronx Heroes Comic Con. He's on his back to back to you Billy grind right now. <laughs> We're here at the Urban Action uh, Showcase, first annual Urban Action Showcase here at the Hilton Hotel. But he's gonna let us know about the update. You know, we try and document everybody who's here. This is a great event, great venue, and that's what it is. How's it going? How's it going? Good to see you. We got our new version, our war edition of World Without Superheroes. It's a new edition of the first four issues of a World Without Superheroes. And we're selling these to raise money for our lawsuit against Marvel and DC who are fighting us over the trademark. And in response to that war that we've been having, war of the real war of independence with DC and Marvel versus Bronx Heroes, we got World War Heroes, which is a spin-off title, and it's a little parody on Captain America. But it's also um, a story that deals with um, after the Vietnam War uh, and what happens to veterans. Uh, a lot of them it talks about homeless vets, Reaganomics, and basically how a lot of our vets were abandoned after the war. And then, of course, we have. Uh, Bronx Heroes 2.0 with artwork with Trevor Von Eden, right? We got his work here. And we have, uh, so this is the second issue. The third issue, we're working out a deal with Paris Cullen, so Paris Cullen can draw. Uh, issue number three of Black Power, right? And we have The Roach also. This is a flip My book. Roach. You like The Roach? <laughs> Well, the roach is fighting a, a predator-looking rat in this uh, issue. <laughs> the roach is fighting the rat. He's fighting the rat. So he, all his villains are going to be like sewer-based creatures at, from New York City, right? And uh, he's basically uh, fighting for the insects because the cockroaches are about to bring the insect apocalypse. So, <laughs> and the rats are the, the rats are siding with the mammals. That means they represent the humans. So it's the rat and the roach. <laughs> <laughs> now this is drawn by me and Chris Duckett. Chris Duckett did the cover. I drew the interior. And of course, this is a, a Kafka-esque Bronx tale, right? Where a guy is bitten by a roach, and it's not radioactive, but it gets bitten. It gets, it gets bitten by a roach. Uh, this is also Chris Duckett and I. It's a, it's a fusion. He draws it, I inks it, and I color it. Nice. And we got our little Starbucks and Superman down there too. Yeah, so I got a little. <laughs> what, what kind of copyrighted prisoners? <laughs> uh, last but not least, we have Heavy Traffic by Dimitri Gubin. Nice, nice. And uh, he's a revolutionary protester who becomes a superhero, right? After the first heavy traffic dies. And we're just talking about uh, encouraging people to be creative. That's what Bronx Heroes is about. And also educating them about history of New York and history of America and, in, and making it in an entertainment field, mixing them together so people can learn about everything they will never learn in school, right? So that's what it, we're about empowering people, giving them knowledge, and having a good time. And that's Bronx Heroes. And Bronx Heroes will be doing a Kickstarter for. Our event, May 3rd, 2014. Be there, okay? Back to you, Billy. Back to you, Billy. Excelsior.